hello friends this is venu in this video i am explaining about uh, how to configure intellij uh, this uh, scala intellij in eclipse okay in my previous video i have explained uh, how to install this intellij and uh, in this video first of all i will explain a little bit about intellij and uh, this is nothing but check uh, and um, one second and uh, First of all, let me install this uh, Scala plugin. That's why first go to and click on plugin. Here you can find basically most of the newbies simply they are searching here. It is nothing but install plugin. These are if you search Scala, there is no sorry S E L A. There is no any Scala plugin. Okay, that's why to install Scala, what should you do? Simply go to bar, go to uh, bottom of this plugin and click on install jet engine plugin okay here you can search anything scala okay otherwise you can search sbt if you search this one automatically it suggests to only scala plugin in this green color is nothing but you are still not yet installed that's why what should you do simply click on this link and if you click on this link it's take little time i'm holding this video and finally after it gets installed after a couple of minutes and click on restart intellij idea okay that means uh, if you restart this one then only it can identify this scala is installed or not that means not only this one if you are installing any plugin intellij restart is mandatory it's highly recommendable okay and uh, this is wait uh, first time is take little time don't mind please wait and um, okay finally it's open now click on create new project mm. and uh, click on new project okay fine automatically it is uh, 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 there are different ways to create project simply click on scala and uh, sbt otherwise marvin also is fine similar but here you can find a scale uh, okay fine scala and go to spt and within the spt click on next and uh, it's fetching the S and now you can create spt project that means what is this project you can write any name let example scala programs okay is a project name it is stored in root folder idea project okay here you didn't find sdk by default it's not available then what should you do click on new and uh, go to oh uh, this jvm and uh, click on and uh, java latest version automatically it scan up where is this location okay click on this link and uh, finally choose sbt version make it default and uh, in my videos i am most quickly i will explain about 2.10.6 that's why scroll down click on 2.10.6 okay and uh, here use import uh, uh, option also highly recommendable but uh, in this video i am i don't use use auto import it is intentionally done for create internally everything by default okay and uh, wait a couple of minutes it take little time to open okay and finally it's open okay wait a few minutes and uh, okay these are come uh, um, it is tips close it intellij tips and these are most frequently you are using these commands that's why that's why I simply click on control 1 sorry alt 1 alt 1 and finally click on scala programs then what it does actually sbt uh, uh, as build sbt is a hard to configure any dependencies like uh, if you are installing spark or any spark streaming applications at the time you have to configure here and first of all come to the point instead of spark i am explaining about to int this scala programs that's why click on scala programs and right click and uh, wait and uh, click on new and click on directory okay now you can enter src and uh, some main and finally main scala 
click on this link and uh, this is created scala okay similarly right click and uh, go to directory and click on target to you and scala and press ok okay now simply right click it on scala and uh, you have to choose make module okay now automatically it is uh, downloading all the scala libraries etc it is in brown color light biscuit color sorry biscuit color it means still not yet install anything okay if you wait couple of minutes automatically if scala is installed then automatically it's uh, converted as light blue okay brown with the green color okay and uh, wait couple of minutes this is it's installed almost okay whereas if you choose auto import automatically is downloading all these libraries you can check this is prog progressed in, at the bottom of this uh, this uh, intellij okay it's take little time be if you you can check if you are using here there is no any scala programs like that to create scala applications okay that's why wait few minutes within couple of minutes it's uh, install scala it is only first time is take little time after that is uh, easy uh, there is no any delay okay and uh, whereas before that uh, in uh, to create a project at the time if you import auto import automatically it's creating all this without uh, entering this directory etc wait few minutes okay finally after a couple of minutes it's opening and project okay first of all click on scala it is uh, it's already changed to light blue color blue color it is and uh, simply click on right click this one to create a pro this uh, package okay it's now you can find scala also now click on project uh, package and uh, in the package give any name your wish in this package i am explaining about scala that's why lane scala is my package okay and uh, finally click on this scala and uh, finally it is simple and click on this project package and click on scala that's it got it and what should you do simply write hello world and click on it is choose object and finally click on okay okay fine that's it now it's starting with this package lane scala and finally you got it by by default it is displaying like that and uh, uh, to print don't print directly like this simply diff and space main that means you everything you must define within the main method if you click on tab automatically it is suggesting but unfortunately not yet uh, it's not getting any suggestion the main design is here you can check here in indexing you can find it at the bottom of this status bar still not yet installed completely that's why it's not suggesting but later uh, after a couple of minutes if you are implementing anything it is suggesting okay wait a few minutes then you can search main method okay wait a few minutes Uh, it's taking little time, I think. That's why. Uh, wait di directly. I'm pasting. This is diff main aux and uh, array. Then, if you enter automatically, it's you will get like this. Okay. Then you can enter anything. Let like example, I want to print hello world. Then it is printing this uh, data. Okay. And uh, not yet installed. This uh, all packages. All you can check the status bars. That's why if 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 you right click this one, there is no compile. I'm right clicking, and also otherwise you can uh, compile this program here. Go to menu and run. Within the run, you can find run. Not yet activated. The main business still it is updating everything wait few minutes 
yes finally almost status bus is ok fine now you can check either right click or click on right click and you can find run hello world ok if you run hello world then wait uh, first program first time is take little time that's why you can check at the bottom of this page and uh, it's taking little time please wait and uh, finally wait wait yes got it you can check this output at the bottom of this page hello world and process finished with zero that means there is no error okay and that means it's same now onwards you you can do anything you can execute on the main method if you are coming from java i hope you can understand what is this main method etc okay but i think you know java basics what is this uh, everything that's why i am not explaining about this concept okay and finally that's it and thank you bye bye